Hey guys and welcome to the ABO Friday Talk Show. I'm your girl at Sister Bright Markajin and today we're gonna to be talking about what is going on in the Big Brother Ninja Sigobe house. <laughs> this one a real Sigobe. <laughs> we're gonna be emphasizing on Bissola and Team Talk 20, my two favorites of all time. <clears throat> <laughs> okay, so when I first set my eyes on Bissola, yeah, in the Big Brother house, when she walked through those doors, yeah, I was like, is it that Didi from Skinny Girl in Transit? Because I love Skinny Girl in Transit, yeah, like that's my all time favorite right now that I'm watching, yeah, I love Skinny Girl in Transit. I was like, ah, Didi, and then Abuka said her name was Bissola. I was like, ah, Bissola, you know, I already loved her, yeah, she already had a presence, yeah, she stole my heart away, she took it away one time. And she became my candidate ever since then. You know, she came into the house, you know, first week passed, second week passed, you know, free spirit. Priscilla was all over the place, loud girl, everybody loved her, funny, yeah. And I said to myself, self, we have a winner. <laughs> But this past week, I do not understand what Bisola came to the Big Brother house to do. Bisola, did you come to look for a husband? Did you come for the 25 million? Did you come to look for love? What did you come to do? Did you come to show everybody you're a good pansha? Did you come to tell everybody, ah, I'm a good kid, so come and kiss me after the show? What did you come to do? Because you're making a total fool of yourself, yeah? I mean, let's talk about Teen Tall Tony. Teen Tall Tony. <laughs> As Big Brother, I will call you. Oh my God, I like Tim Talk Tony. You know, as a person, his his personality is amazing, all shades of amazing. But you are married, yeah. Nobody said people that are married cannot come for Big Brother and Niger. No, but I mean, if you you know, if you have told us, you should have told us from you know from the onset that ah, I'm married. But if I see kiss, I go kiss. If I see punch, I go punch, yeah? So now everybody's mind will be settled. Right now, you are deceiving Bisola. And Bisola is falling for you sheepishly. Like a goat. Like an a woo. Ah! God! Men are so amazing. Men are all shades of amazing. And you see all these girls out there insulting Bisola. Ah, Bisola, you're a fool. You're an idiot. But it's just the same thing that is going on in your life. You're, it doesn't stop the fact that your boyfriend is married. It doesn't stop the fact that yeah, your boyfriend has a side chick. And you're insulting Bisola. The only difference here is that we are watching Bisola. Nobody's watching you. <laughs> yeah? Oh my god, this is so embarrassing. I can't wait to, you know, to see the look on Bisola's face when she gets out of the Big Brother house. Because, you know, now she's feeling, I finally found love. God, somebody's finally going to marry me. Yeah? After the Big Brother house, we're going to marry. Kiniko, Kiniko. This guy is married. Men are so amazing. You know, they are the same all over the world. Can you imagine? Bisola, Bisola is an embarrassment. Seriously, because, you know, I just thought Bisola is going to be the kind of girl, you know, that she would just, you know, she would just be, she would just be funny. She would be, you know, she would be cracking everybody up. She would be all over the place. She would be, you know, loud. She would be, you know, she put people in their places. You know, she would be the quarreling type. Then, before you know it, she's winning the money. But no. Bisola came there to find husband. She came to the house for a whole nother thing. Different thing. She didn't come into a five millionaire. Anyways, guys, tell me what you feel. Do not forget you can join in the conversation by subscribing and commenting. Tell me what you feel. Is Bisola really foolish? What is she? What is going on? Tell me. <laughs> Till I come your way next week. I remain your girl at the Surprise Mokajin. Bye bye, guys.